Tom with Kelly Moto TV. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the garage and welcome back. The 2020 Ducati Street Fighter V4S is up on the lift for a uh, remodification, I guess you can say. Now, I want to make this clear right up front. This modification is only being changed because one, Omex Racing sent me a sump guard. There is nothing wrong with the Desmo World uh, sump guard that I have on there except that it has drug on the ground, so it's worked. So thank you, Desmo World, for that. But I like the the uh, uh, O Max Racing design. It kind of looks cooler. It's more rounded. It's a little bigger on the bottom, but uh, it's got some cooling fins on it, which will probably scrape. But um, I want to tell you guys how important these are to have on your bike. One only X Ram uh, took out his oil pan on a bump just cleared the bottom of his uh, uh, Ducati Street Fighter, oil everywhere, make sure you guys get a sump guard. It doesn't matter who, Omax Racing, uh, Desmo World, um, there's another company that's got them out. It doesn't matter who, you've gotta put one on, but I'm installing the new Omax Racing. So let's uh, go ahead and we're gonna change the oil while we're at it and uh, swap out the sump guard. And I'll show you again, Again, there's nothing wrong with this one except that it's scraped on the ground already. So it's already plummeted and hit some uh, rocks. But uh, look, for a hundred bucks, you should probably be changing these out once a year anyway. So uh, let's get to change these things over and uh, see how the new one looks. All right, so you can tell this thing works. Um, not only has it hit the edge of it here, but you can see definitely good protection, you guys. So if you guys don't have the sump guard, get one. Like I said, I just like the look of this one. It's, it's kind of nice. Um, it's a little bit um, taller and a little bit narrower. So uh, again, this is Omax Racing. So we're gonna go ahead and pull the filter off. And yeah, I don't know, that just looks nice and clean myself. So let's go ahead and get the filter dropped and uh, get the new uh, sump guard on. All right, just as a tip and a trick, I like to put the um, oil filter guard in with the new gaskets, it's tend to, it tends to be a little bit tight fit. So what I do is I thread uh, all of the bolts through. And what we're gonna do is we're going to evenly tighten this, um, uh, this these, uh, oil filter cover. So we're just gonna go ahead and get these started. And then we're gonna work this cover in and then we'll remove the bolts once the cover in and then put the sump cover in. All right, guys, let's say you're at the position that you want to add the new sump guard on. So, and you don't want to change your oil. It's really easy. You're just going to remove the three oil filter bolts, okay? Uh, the, the cover bolts. You're just going to remove them from the oil cover and not remove the oil filter cover, okay? You're going to take your new sump and the three bolts that they provide. So I'll take this first bolt. And what you're going to do is you're going to line it up and you're simply just gonna start threading the bolts on. So let's go ahead and get all of the bolts lined up and started to be threaded. Let's do the front first. And then start with the next one. So we got a little long neck Allen. All right, last but not least, once you've got the three screws on, we're going to tighten this down to 13 Newton meters. And just like that, we have the Omax Racing oil pan guard on. And uh, like I said, if you guys don't have an oil pan guard, you have to get one. If you're on a Street Fighter, 
spend the hundred bucks, you have to absolutely get one. Like I said, it doesn't matter what manufacturer. Uh, I will link the Omax uh, Racing uh, down below if you guys are interested in that. Desmo World sells one, uh, and uh, I don't know, I forget who the other new guy is selling one too. So um, make sure you get it because if you hit a bump, it will take your oil pan off. Like I said, one only X Ram took the bottom of his uh, Street Fighter pan off, and uh, I think he only had like two or 300 miles on the bike. So um, make sure you guys get it. But thank you guys for sticking around, hanging with me in the garage while I change out the uh, guard. Uh, make sure you guys do the normal. Hit the subscribe button, smash the like button, and then ring the bell notification. Bell notification is gonna give you future notification of future content because uh, we are heading out to uh, this weekend, we are going to be at Button Willow, and then next weekend, we're like Trockapalooza. We have five track days in like eight days. So stick around, you guys. Also, we've got some modifications to do to the uh, Street Fighter. Stay tuned for that. It's going to be an epic. I've not seen it done on anybody's. Uh, and then, of course, stay tuned because we've got the Street Fighter V2 in any day right now. But uh, thank you guys again, and uh, we'll see you next video. Bye, guys.